thank you for joining us today. We would like to take this opportunity to share with you our exciting plans for the new Duke of Edinburgh Award Centre at Derwin College. The Duke of Edinburgh Award started in 2014 when the college trialled the Bronze Award with a group of 11 students. The award has grown in popularity ever since and in 2018 the college was awarded directly licensed centre status. This means we now deliver the Duke of Edinburgh Award under our own operating licence, supported by the wonderful Central England team. For those unfamiliar with the Duke of Edinburgh's award, all students have to undertake skill, volunteering and physical based challenges throughout the year as well as the expedition. To date the College have celebrated 124 bronze, 103 silver and 38 gold awards, which recognises the progress so far. In September 2020, work began on the dedicated Duke of Edinburgh Award Centre and the College is proud to lead the way in creating a bespoke on-site activity centre focused on supporting adults with special educational needs and disabilities. Work started on the new DOV Centre at Derwin College in September 2020 and has evolved to become a base which students associate with the award. The area offers classroom space and an outdoor area where students can learn and practice the skills required for the DOV award. The centre provides opportunities for students to meet volunteering and skill sections of the award. It also provides training resources and equipment to help prepare students for expeditions. This will give the students the skills and confidence to take on the challenge of an expedition away from college. Expedition skills can be practiced safely on site using equipment such as a canoe simulator, which allows students to try the art of boarding and disembarking from a canoe before they get out onto the water. Different types of uneven terrain and varied styles and gates offer students the chance to familiarise themselves with some of the obstacles they might encounter in the countryside. Resources such as tunnels and balance beams will support students to develop physical skills needed for negotiating the great outdoors during expeditions. The site also benefits from plenty of space to practice erecting tents, lighting and maintaining a campfire, getting to grips with cooking on a transier, and perfecting the all-important hot chocolate and marshmallows. The centre is home to Caitlin's Cabin, named in memory of an extraordinary student who never allowed disability to be a barrier to her ambition. Caitlin's Cabin features a campsite kitchen area where students can practice cooking and washing up skills. I was a really good friend of Caitlin's. She would honestly be so proud of all the work that is happening at the DOV Centre. We are really excited about the changes that are happening at the DOV Centre. However, we have more plans for the future. We would like solar powers for our campsite kitchen, for heating and electrics, and because we care for the environment. We would also like an outdoor classroom to learn outside, whatever the weather. We have a lot more plans for the future, but it all depends on funding. If you can help in any way, please get in touch.